All right, one of the disadvantages of doing these uh, virtual uh, labs is that you don't get to physically handle the, the components, in particular the resistors. And when I teach this, uh, these next few labs, the resistors and uh, series in parallel and the RC circuit, you, uh, uh, you, you know, I give a lecture and then I actually hand you the kits and you have to go through and pick the devices and uh, you pick the devices by reading the color code. And that's what I have presented here. Uh, this is table A4 right from your, uh, you have this table in your appendix uh, from your physics laboratory experiments manual uh, by Wilson and Hernandez Hall, uh, eighth edition. This is table A5, it's color code for resistors, uh, composition type it says in the parentheses. So basically you have uh, color bands on the resistors and the, the, the colors are listed here in the table, black, brown, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, or violet, gray, and white. And it just goes from zero to nine. So black is zero, brown is one, red is two, three is orange, orange and so forth. Uh, so you have three color bands that tell you the, um, tell you the, the value, the first two, are just the numbers that they give. And the third is the multiplier, 10 to the whatever, 10 to the uh, red would be 10 to the two, so you get 100. Uh, yellow would be 10 to the fourth, so you get 10,000. Um, so it, you, you get a two digit number from the first two uh, bands, and then uh, you get a multiplier. So they give you the example, for example, of the bands on a resistor are red, uh, black, orange, uh, the resistance is 2020 times 10 to the uh, uh, 3, which is 1,000, or that's uh, 20,000 ohms or 20 kilo ohms. Um, now, these are some, the, in fact, we'll be using these resistors. Uh, I've got two of them blanked out so that you can't uh, see the values, and I want you to uh, send me the, uh, you don't have to print this. Uh, this photo, but you need to send me the uh, the values uh, that that are presented here. Um, so, uh, if you look, you'll see this first one is a brown, red, brown. So brown is one, red is two, so that's twelve, and then times ten to the one is just ten, so it's twelve times ten, one hundred and twenty. Uh, this one is. Uh, blue, gray, uh, brown, so that's 6, 8, um, 68 times 10 to the 1 is 60, 68 times 10, that's 680. Here we have uh, red, 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 which is 2, 2 times 10 to the 2. So 22 times, uh, 22 times uh, 100 is uh, 2,200. And so that's 2.2K, 2, 2,200 uh, ohms or 2.2 2 .2 kilo ohms. Now this is a uh, green, blue, red, and I've got the value here. Uh, I'll, I'll provide a space for you to answer on, uh, on, the, uh, on Canvas. Uh, this one is uh, brown, uh, brown, black, orange. That is orange there. Uh, you can see that it's, uh, so it's one zero times 10 to the three. So that's 10 times a thousand, that's 10,000 ohms. This is orange, orange, orange. So it's up to you to figure it out and uh, you're gonna I blank it out so you can write, you don't have to write your answer on here, just write your answer and send it to me. Uh, I'll, I'll give you the, uh, the place to uh, fill that out. Uh, this one is, uh, brown, black, and yellow. So that's one zero times 10 to the fourth. So that's 10 times, um, uh, it, it's 10 times uh, 10,000. So that's uh, 100,000. And this is uh, yellow, violet, yellow. 
So that's uh, four seven times 10, uh, 10,000. Uh, 47 times 10,000 is 470,000. Uh, so um, that's the, the color code. Um, oh, I didn't talk about the tolerance. The tolerance um, is, is silver, gold, or red. I think all of these are gold. They all look gold on this. Uh, you can see there's a bit of gap between the first three bands and, and this last band. That's the tolerance. If it's silver, those are 10% um, resistors. If they're gold, they're 5%. If they're red, they're 2%. Um, and if you're doing NASA space work, they, they usually use micro um, micro resistors, but but uh, you would have a higher tolerance uh, than that. Okay, so I think the uh, in the next video I'm going to actually take some measurements, and we'll see if these fall into the the five percent range. But we'll stop it here.